walking through the valley of the shadow of death. Look at that. Right, today we're back on this. Um, this is technically day two of quarantine and uh, he's chilling because I'm talking to you. Uh, body work day today, that's what we've decided. So we're gonna cut some more rust out, weld some new bits in and make it a bit more solid uh, with the aim of the end of this quarantine and um, we're not sure exactly how long we're going to be off work um, first of all it was said 12 weeks but that could be shortened to four weeks so technically we've got four weeks to get this bodywork done and possibly even a coat of paint blown over it that's the aim so we'll see how well we get on uh, I think today it is just going to be stuff like this. Uh, we're going to start at the back again. Um, I don't know if you remember last time I did do that. Uh, well, where's my finger? That top back corner just up there. So I'm going to do the bit on the other side. That's what I'm going to start with. Uh, Jordan's been sort of de-seaming the bumper type thing. It's going to be a bit of a strange one. I've never seen that before. But he's gonna have like a floating sort of bumper. You're not really gonna see the bump where the bumper points are, so it's quite clever. Um, and then of course we've got to do wheel arch tubbing. That's not gonna be in this video, but that's in something to come. Right then, let's crack on. Let's get this down uh, at a reachable height. Let's do something. Right, well, this is on the bodywork side of things. I think this is where I left you last time. As you can see, we've got a little bit of the old uh, brown cancer starting to appear here, so. We've got to clean all that up, make sure there's none of that left, cut a section out of here, repair that bit first, and then I I made the last panel the other side, and I think I did quite a good job. Let me just take you back. I did quite a good job of that. Even Dave Jaguar said, well done, so I feel quite proud of that really. But this time, kind of a cheat. I've got that, an off cut from a previous repair I did. Ah, uh, yeah, we did actually have the other side as well, which I didn't really know about until we tidied up the garage yesterday. So, hey. right, so I'm going to cut this bit out now, get this repaired, <coughs> and then cut that bit and put it in that bit. Right, there we go. That's that piece that's going to go in there to repair that inner section. So I'm going to get that splashed in now. Never have that feeling that someone's watching you. Ah, oh, there he is. Right, gonna weld this in. by magic. That's that bit in now. Dress back a little bit. We just now need to piece this rusty bit of tat in there. Although it's not going to stay rusty because uh, we've got a right wicked little tool. Where is it? Oh, so wait, no, that, there it is. Look at this. This is uh, Jordan's own bit of kit. Obviously bought from uh, Mr. Expensive, but it's pretty bloody good. We, uh, I've cleaned all this up with it and it takes it back to a shiny metal really quickly and hardly wears a thing. I'm, oh, I want one, it's good. Right, let me clean up this uh, rusty bit of metal with this thing. And then we'll show you what it looks like before it goes in. There we go, using that little buffing tool. Wow, super shiny. I can't hold it in there straight, but uh, you get the idea. That's gonna be the little repair patch for it. Let's get that in there then. Always a noisy bugger. <laughs> Don't forget the spot weld holes. Right, let me weld this in. Right, there you go. There's the raw uncut bit. You see that little bit there? I missed it. But there you go, that is splashed into place. So obviously just gotta grind all that back, make it nice and uh, thing. Oh, I've just seen another little hole there as well. Look at that. Oh, I don't know, it's not perfect first time. I won't get applause for that, will I? <laughs> right, 
let me uh, dob two bits of weld on there and then grind it all back. And that's one other repair done. Boom, there it is. So it's a little bit reflecty, but that's that bit done. Just need to get some rust protection on it. And uh, he's just about to make some more noise. So I'm gonna move on to the next bit, wherever that may be. It's nice when you're out here on a sunny day and your neighbor gets the angle grinder out as well. The other's neighbors must love us. <laughs> anyway, Jordan's uh, cracking on with that repair there and found another little bit of rust. So decided to cut that out and that always turns out more than what it at first appears, doesn't it? So I've got my little bits ready to weld in there. Just waiting for this chap here to finish with a welder. And then um, I'm looking for something else to do. Right, while I've been waiting for Jordan to finish using the welder, I've made a little tool. Now, I'm not gonna tell you what it's for. See if you can guess. What do you reckon we're gonna use that for? It's just a piece of checker plate, but it's got that cut out of it. So, drop a comment and let me know what you think we're gonna be using this for. Jordan's been quite busy along the back here. He's been uh, sorting all that bit out. So there's a couple of little more bits which we found. This little bit there, and that little bit there. So I'm probably gonna get on that, to get that uh, replaced with some fresh metal. And then I think that is pretty much our back end ready to roll. So uh, I think the plan to finish today is going to be to rub the back down and maybe even get a coat of primer on it to get us one step ahead I suppose we'll see how we go but so far so good whoa what's going on here got some body filler going in now it's looking good what are you doing oh, I'm just chilling just watching my body Filler. Body filler, yeah. No, so that's what we're doing now. Well, that's what Jordan's doing now. Getting some of this body filler in, smoothing off that back end, making that look super sexy. Yeah. And uh, I'm just doing these two little bits, that one there and that one round there. Just welded them in, so it's got to dress them up, make them look good. And uh, yeah, I think that's all the welding done on the back end. So I think the uh, DA is gonna come out next, get that all smoothed and looking good. Maybe, just maybe, primer. Maybe, yeah, might even get some primer on it. That'll be good, that will be good. So has anyone guessed what that tool's for yet? Mm, I'm not too sure myself. Well, I made it, so I know. But uh, it's uh, certainly going to come in useful. So come on in, leave some comments. What do you reckon it's going to be for? We will let you know in the next episode. So I think we might DA a bit of this off, maybe get some primer on it, and uh, well, we'll see you in a tick. Um, we've hit a serious problem serious problem now um, I don't know how we're gonna get over this let me just flip the camera around and show you what the problem is yeah um, we finished that fuck it um, I've drunk too much I don't know where we're gonna carry on with this <laughs> oh shit um, well, we're kind of carrying on, but I've, uh, 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 yeah, I don't know. I uh, don't even know what I'm fucking doing. Well, I've still got a little bit left. That's it then. 
that's that bottle gone. Um, but back to the mini, the bodywork side of things. Yeah. We're just concentrating on the back end today. And uh, as that's the one bit that everyone's going to see. Yeah, everyone's going to see the back end because uh, it's going to be so fast. It's no one going to be able to get traction. No one is going to see the front of it because it's gonna, just going to be a blur. And uh, yeah, that's it. So we're body working the back end because, like I say, that's going to be the important bit. And. Uh, I think that's going to sort us for today. And then uh, another bottle of JD tomorrow. I mean, um, another bottle of Enthusiasm tomorrow. We are going to be down on this tomorrow. Finishing off Looking forward to it. End. Finishing off the back end. Potentially, we're going to primer tomorrow. If we don't get it around to it. Tomorrow. Well, I mean, potentially. I mean, the, the rear quarters, we just need to uh, do something with the wheel arches and i think we could potentially primer down to the b post tomorrow we could do that we could do tiny bit of welding and uh tiny bit of body work left only problem is is how many more we'll uh pull out no so how far will we get tomorrow no that's it i'm still working i'm still working sort of <laughs> yep, I'm on the flamingos. Okay. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, I think we could uh, could get the back end in primer tomorrow, and that uh, at least that's that bit done, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Thank you for joining us on this uh, epic trip. Getting the back end done. <laughs> yeah, uh, until tomorrow. I think tomorrow is going to be the uh, the pinnacle of Glanza Mini Build. We are going to uh, finish off the back end. Yeah, thanks for joining us. And uh, see you tomorrow. Say bye. See ya. Bye-bye. <laughs>